Did you know the average household spends more than $1,900 a year in energy costs? Nearly half of which goes to heating and cooling. A programmable thermostat, used properly, can keep you comfortable while helping you use less energy, prevent greenhouse gas emissions that contribute to global warming, and save around $180 a year in energy costs. Hi, I'm Wendy Reed, and on behalf of the U.S. Environmental Protection Agency's Energy Star Program, I'm going to show you how a programmable thermostat is one of the best ways you can save energy. The key is knowing how to pick the right one for your home and to use it properly. So first, let's head to the store and check out our options. If you have ever shopped for a programmable thermostat in the past, you know that there are many options to choose from, so how do you know which one is best for you? Think about your family schedule and how often you're away from home. This will help you decide between the three types of programmable thermostats, a seven-day model, a five-and-two-day, and a five-one-one-day model. Each model has its own benefits, depending on your family's schedule. The seven-day model gives you the most flexibility with settings for each day of the week, whereas the five-one-one and five-and-two-day models allow you to program different weekday and weekend settings and be sure to look for one that's on the EPA's Energy Star label. Every Energy Star qualified programmable thermostat comes with four pre-programmed settings that make sure your home is comfortable at the right time. Many models also feature touchpad programming and backlit displays, as well as indicators to let you know when it's time to change your system's filter or if your system is malfunctioning. Once you get your thermostat home, Make sure to install it on an interior wall, away from vents and any other source of heat or drafts. Okay, so your thermostat's installed. Now it's time to put it to use. This is the part that many homeowners find the most daunting, but it can be simple. Let me show you how. Before you program your thermostat, consider when your family wakes up, leaves the house, and goes to bed. You can set your thermostat according to your family's schedule to automatically adjust the temperature at each of these times. Here are a few setting recommendations from the EPA. In the winter, set the temperature to drop by 8 degrees when you're away and when you're sleeping. In the summer, set the temperature to go up by 7 degrees when you're away and 4 degrees when you're sleeping. You can also ask your HVAC contractor how to optimize your settings during your next preseason checkup. Once you've programmed your settings, resist the urge to override your thermostat or place it permanently on hold at a constant temperature. Remember, turning the temperature way up or down won't help heat or cool your home any faster, but it will make your system work overtime and can wreak havoc on your energy bills. There are times when you should adjust your settings, like when going out of town. Use the hold or vacation button to help you save even more when you're away for a long period of time. If you're having trouble programming your thermostat, don't give up. Just get out your manual. It has all the info you need to program and maintain your optimal settings. If you don't have the manual, give the manufacturer a call or check out their website. Another thing to remember is your thermostat may run on batteries. Change the battery once a year. Some models even come with indicators that let you know when it's time to replace the battery. We know that some of you are attached to your manual thermostat or aren't able to switch to a programmable one. If that's the case, you can still make the most of your manual thermostat. Typically, adjusting the temperature by 5 to 8 degrees is a good rule of thumb for saving energy. Properly using a programmable thermostat at home is one of the easiest things you can do to lower your energy costs. It's as simple as set and save. To learn more, check out the Energy Star website at energystar.gov pts. And remember, even small energy saving changes at home can make a big difference in helping us win the fight against global warming. I'm Wendy Reed, and on behalf of the Environmental Protection Agency, thanks for watching.